All right, hey guys, welcome back to another episode with me, Anthony, and uh, today in this episode, I target white bass. Uh, these fish are so fun to catch. I love catching white bass, open water or through the hard water, and uh, they don't taste too bad either. They're actually pretty good as long as you fillet out that mud line. They're not bad, uh, but definitely one of the best fish uh, to catch, one of the most fun fish to catch, uh, for me anyways, and uh, they're actually pretty hard to catch through the ice, uh, they are a fish that are they're schooling and they're always moving. They're always on the move, uh, they're, and they're always um, eating. So they're aggressive. But the thing is, is they're also very finicky sometimes and tricky to catch. It's kind of like playing a cat and mouse game with them. Uh, when you do find them, you can always you know you might mark them, but they, you can't get them to bite, or you don't mark anything at all because they're always swimming around. So. Anybody that's ever fished for white bass, I think you know what I mean. And if you ever fish like uh, big systems like Winnebago, then you would understand what I mean by it. it's definitely a cat and mouse game. And it's hard to get them to bite sometimes. But when they are biting, it is a blast. But today in this episode, the uh, the my audio wasn't very good uh, because I was surrounded by a bunch of people. And I think they were all kind of like wondering what to do to catch fish and such and they were having a hard time so i was i was being very quiet uh ninja mode if you want to say so i think i'll just have music playing in the background and just kind of have it going through and just uh you know show clips of me catching fish and uh what i used was basically a small spoon uh cast master silver and i used one of my uh noodle rods it's actually the al dente 28 inch model uh noodle something i bought that a couple years back it's a pretty good rod I use I think three pound test, so this is definitely a like um, a finesse setup, a finesse tactic setup for these white bass. And uh, I know other guys out there will use like jigger wraps and uh, bigger spoons or like dead stick minnows and stuff like that. That all works. Um, it's just in particular to this setup, I I was using a uh, a noodle rod, and uh, it worked really well for me. So if you guys ever uh, want to try that out for white bass, that's another thing. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the footage. I had a lot of fun catching these fish. Uh, I don't target them a lot through the ice, uh, maybe a couple times a season. And uh, yeah, I'm really glad I got into them today. And I'm glad that I was able to record it and share it with you guys. And if you guys have any questions on how to target white bass and uh, such things like that, just leave a comment down below. And I enjoy, uh, I enjoy the support. And uh, if you guys like my content, please subscribe. And uh, if you guys have any ideas for me to like what, what I should fish for, just leave a comment down below and I'll get back to it. Thanks, guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Until next time, catch you in the next one.
this is the size of one right here. Just 